Hello, welcome. In this short video, let us look at the application of moment method for estimation of parameters of two distributions. The first one is double exponential distribution, and the second one is discrete uniform and discrete uniform distribution. So moment, so moment method for estimation. So first one is we are talking about double exponential distribution. Here the random variable belongs to a distribution uh, with parameters mu and sigma. So it belongs to a distribution with the random variable x and the parameters mu and sigma. So our goal is to find the parameters mu and sigma from a given data of n values. That is, given this probability density function fx of x defined as to 1 by 2 times sigma, 1 by 2 times sigma exponential of minus x modulus of x minus mu divided by sigma so given this density function where sigma is always positive so given this density function we want to find mu and sigma from a data of n samples that is from theory we know that the mean of this distribution that is expectation of x of this that is the mean of this random variable is given by mu and the variance that is the variance of this random variable the variance of this random variable is given by 2 times sigma square and from the data that is from n data points the sample mean is given the sample mean is given the sample mean is defined as 1 by n summation i is equal to 1 to n xi that is this is the sample mean similarly the sample variance is given by 1 by n summation over i i equal to 1 to n xi minus x bar whole squared so that is the sample variance now we can uh, solve for the unknown parameters mu and sigma by equating uh, these two results that is we equate mu to the sample mean and 2 sigma square to the sample variance so for the first equation we have mu equal to x bar that is the estimate of the parameter mu this mu hat is nothing but the sample mean that is 1 by n summation over i xi and similarly for the variance 2 sigma square is equal to the sample variance therefore the estimate of the parameter sigma that is sigma hat is given by square root of 1 by 2 n summation i equal to 1 to n x i minus x bar squared that is the estimate of the parameter sigma it is moving on that is moving on to discrete uniform distribution that is the second part of the problem this discrete uniform distribution defined by the probability mass function p of x equal to 1 by capital n where capital n is the range of possible values that is the random variable can take any of the values from 1 to capital n now so from theory we know that the mean value of this random variable x is given by n plus 1 by 2 here the random variable x follows a discrete uniform distribution with the probability mass function defined as 1 by capital n where the value of x is from 1 to capital n that means it is discrete and integer values so the, ex the expectation of its random variable is defined as n plus 1 by 2 and from the data that is given n samples the sample mean is defined as 1 by n summation over i xi now equating these two we have n plus 1 by 2 is equal to x bar therefore the estimate of the parameter n is defined as is given by 2 times x bar minus 1 or in other words 2 times the mean value minus 1 so that is the estimate of the parameter n so to summarize in this video we have looked at the application of moment method for estimation of the parameters of two distributions the first one is double exponential distribution where the random variable x follows this double exponential distribution where the probability density function is defined as 1 by 2 sigma e power minus modulus of x minus mu by sigma where sigma is always positive from so from theory we know that the mean value is defined by mu and the variance is defined by 2 sigma square and from the data the sample mean is given by the average and the sample variance is given by 1 by n summation square of the differences and then by equating the theory and the sample values we get the estimate of the parameters that is the estimates of the parameters mu hat is, dif uh, is found to be the sample mean itself and then the sigma hat is the square root of 1 by 2n and then summation of the squared differences so that is the 
uh, parameter estimates for the double exponential distribution. Similarly, for the discrete uniform distribution, where the probability mass function is given by 1 by Kaplan, where Kaplan is the number of possible values for the random variable x, and then the mean is defined as n plus 1 by 2, and the equating this mean to the sample mean, we can clearly see that the estimate of Kaplan is 2x bar minus 1. That is the 2 times the sample mean. Thanks for watching.